So if you have all of your photos in the Google Photos cloud, you may notice that some of your pictures and videos may not show up. You can check and see the files that you have you know, tried to back up to the cloud and the ones that you've had problems with by clicking on storage here and then choose unsupported videos. I've just cleaned mine out and basically what I did was just highlight all of them and download them into one folder. And now I'll show you how you can recover those videos using just a free software. And generally these photos will show up in your unsupported videos when there's a problem with the video file itself. Something contained in the data side of the file is corrupted and so Google Photos can't read it. Here are the videos that I downloaded and some of them I have already restored. But you'll see when I try to open up this video, it's going to come back and give me an error message because something is wrong with the video file itself. So it can't be played. Okay, so to recover your files, what I use is this app called Untrunk. And one of the interesting things about this app is that you will need a video file shot with the same camera in the same camera settings as a reference file. But as long as you have that, you should be able to restore your file without any problem. Now, let me show you how you can do that. Once you have downloaded the file and extracted, then what I run is the untrunk graphic user interface. And you do that by just after wherever you have extracted the file, and then you just double click the graphic interface program file. And now what you're going to do is choose a reference file and then your file that is truncated or damaged. So choosing the uh, camera, which has shot the same file, right? Which is this GoPro camera here. That's my reference file. And then I will choose the file that is damaged here, shot with the same camera. And then click on repair. Okay, now once you see the screen, you can see the job's done, right? You can close it. And now you see it has the same file renamed with underscore fixed at the end. But now when I double click that file, it plays without any problem. And that's how you get it done. And that's how you can take your unsupported videos from Google Photos, fix them, and then upload them back to your Google Photos cloud. All right. Thanks for watching.